Like, yeah, look at that. Oh, no. Dropped in the sand. But yeah. You. We out. Big. What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Um, today in this episode, we're going to do a bit of a dam talk. Um, if you can't tell by the sound of my voice, I'm a bit crook. Um, yeah, been hectic. This is, by the time you see this, I'm filming this episode Friday. And by the time you see this, will be Sunday. Um, <clears throat> But yeah, we didn't get to go out and do no eps because um, Dad ended up going, uh, he was supposed to be home Thursday, but we ended up going down to Perth, spend the night with him at the hotel, at a hotel, um, because he's going to fly over to Queensland. I'll see if he wants to send me some footage of what he's doing. Um, but yeah, fly over to Queensland to go pull some rig out a hole or I don't know, I didn't quite listen, but yeah, we went down to Perth. Spent the night down in Perth on his boss. Um, yeah, and then that's when the uh, sickness hit us all. It's a bit fluey, like runny nose, <coughs> phlegmy throat, blocked nose, um, and yeah, a bit of a cough. Um, but yeah, it's not going to stop me getting out of here. It'll probably be good for me. Um, but yeah, we're just heading to Tree Dam now. It's supposed to be Yabby Dam. Um, but yeah, there's a bit of a twist in this video. There's trout dam up there, if I rock. There's tree dam. And yeah, you'll see. You'll see why it's very interesting. And I'm doing this video to show you guys. And I've got my jet boil in the back. Catch some big dogs. I'm gonna do a cook up um, under a tree. Because I'm not gonna use like light any fires because she is a windy, hot, hot day. So you might see me go for a swim or whatever. I just picked up the camera and just came outside and just, you know, started filming. So yeah, last video didn't do good, too good. Um, the fox shooting, but I think it was fox shooting. Not a lot of you people like that kind of stuff. Um, so yeah, let us know down in the comments if you like it or not. But um, yeah, it was a good night. Some videos are good, some videos are bad. Even the top of, like, even the biggest, biggest YouTubers that I watch have a shit video sometimes. But, oh, pulling up tree dam now. Um, see you guys when we pull the nets. Alright, we're pulling up the first net, pyramid. Um, let's see how well I do this one hand. It looks like I've got nothing anyway, so well. And yes, we put a lot of yabbies in here and um, catching nothing. And it is the weather now, nice hot spring days coming in the summer, so yeah. And I hope I got that on film. A big yabby just kicked out there. Uh, Oh yeah, here, here we got some yabs. A couple small ones. Oh well, future yabbies. If I bring a bucket, I'd actually take these guys up um, to a different to the dam up there, but because I don't, I'll let them back go. Um, gold fishing. <coughs> I'll insert a picture and I'll show you. Like here, yeah, there's hope. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Nothing. Two 
be fair, it was upside down. But anyways. Yes, this is tree down, where we put all the yabbies. And um, as you can see there, we only caught two small ones. But a big one did kick out of this one, but... Oh well, now here's, here's where the twist comes. We're going up to the trout down. I place nets in there. There's a frog up there. I place nets in there. And um, yeah, got a good feeling about this. Because I found the biggest claw I've ever seen from a yabby on the bank the other day when we went out for a swim. I'll actually put this picture in right here. And um, that, sorry about the wind guys. That got me really, really, really excited. So, I thought I'd put some, because uh, when we first came to the farm, the previous owners did say that there was yabbies in this dam, nothing in this dam or the dam over the road. Um, so we started yabbing, my first couple videos started yabbing. Um, I did the canoe episode and all that. Um, yeah, so we started yabbing. We got a couple, a couple keepers, you know, a couple eaters, and then we stopped catching them. And now, since we've stopped catching them, um, I reckon they've had time to breed up. They've had at least two seasons, so time to breed up. And the old dogs have unburied and um, like had babies and that. Um, I have put a bucket of yabbies in here since, but only a couple. I just, uh, it's across, like, I thought they were walking, but it would be most likely they are walking out of this dam because this car is downhill. They wouldn't walk uphill, but I'll show you anyways. We'll jump the fence, um, and yeah, I'll give you a look. I right, just coming over the dam bank. So I've done a couple of episodes, well, you haven't seen them because I didn't catch anything, but then a couple, started a couple episodes. Me coming down here trying to fish these guys out. Absolutely zero, nothing. No trout, so. Yeah, I'm gonna pull these nets in and let's see. God. I was upside down. No good. Means all the baits falling out. No. Oh, I've got to rebate that one on the other side. On the bank. Oh. Well, that's not a good sign. I want to do a cook up. Hopefully, that one over there. Put four in here, so we've still got quite a bit of um, uh, quite a bit of chance. I'm gonna see you guys. There's one. Nothing. This is a bit worrying. Maybe it won't be a cooking up video. I still go for a swim and I'll still post it because I don't have no backup videos, but... Oh! Yeah, a couple of yabbies, just keep it there. Keep it there. Too many. So there's one. Oh, nearly got me. Two tiny little ones. Be good for bait, but we'll let these guys grow up here. Come on, buddy. Oh, you flip that over. Soft shell. Little soft shell one. So he's a bit old. Look there. Well, there's keeper. Nice semi alright dog. There's another little one, so a couple. They're mostly little. Let 
You're staying. We don't need this bucket. But yeah, little one. There you go. Have a good life, buddy. This is a better looking dam, anyways. So yeah, there's the bigger one. Small little bucket. I'll go put him in the shade. We'll go put this last pot. Fingers bloody crossed. But a good thing is too, I've been catching a lot of um like little minnows out of here, like Western minnow. And I'm sitting there thinking, how have they got in there? So I reckon like a bird's from like, cause we got Western minnows in the creek. I reckon a bird has gone, um, eating eggs or eating the mum, uh, like a uh, fish with eggs and dropped them in, like when they shit, drop them in here and they've hatched. I'll show you, I'll show you, I'll show you. Over in this corner, you see all the little bust ups? I might have one in this pot because I always catch one in this pot. But then I started thinking that the trout have reproduced, but I don't think so. That'd be a good outcome as well. Oh yeah. Heavy. Oh. Holy crap. See what I mean? Horse lights, Jesus. I need to bring that out as well. That's with no bait as well. Keep. Yeah. Get my bag out. Get eggs, keep. Get eggs, keep. Bit too small. Keep. Too small. Keep. Throw it back. Back, back. We'll keep us. He's a bit dead. He's turning a bit green as well. I'll let him go. Oh, there we go. Keeper. He's got a small claw keeper. There's enough for a feed for me. I could keep this bloke, but I, I'm only feeding myself. But yeah, look at them all. Shit ton in the trap then. A bit. I'm a bit confused, guys. Oh, I might keep that one, actually. This is a nice one. Yeah, I'm a bit confused. I've caught some out of here. Oh, I've caught some out of here the other day, like a shit ton. I'll show you some pictures of the keepers that I got. I'll insert them now while I put all these guys back. <sighs> tiny, tiny ones. Tiny, tiny ones. Tiny, tiny ones. So yeah, Trout Dam has turned into um, the new Yabby Dam. And we did want to put Barrow in here this summer. But we can't find Barrow anywhere. Plus, they probably will decimate the Yabbies. We don't want to do that. This one must have eggs. Yeah, you can just tail kill it. Yeah, so I might put these tube, this tube back. Oh, there's another one here. Whew. Might put this tube back in, put it in with no bait for now. Go down there. Because tomorrow i got a mate coming over, maybe. Um, with his motorbike. And yeah, we'll probably go check out some other spots. But yeah. Um, I've got a creek that I've found. Like, little motorbike right away. I might go, um, you know, go check that out. Um, but yeah. We've got a feed, that's good. Um, yeah, I have to come up later on and rebate. <coughs> but yeah, so we've got, we'll take it back under the shade of the tree here, check them out, see how many we've got. Um, enough to fit in the jet boil, hopefully. Um, if there's a couple that won't fit, I'll just um, let a bunch go. Might have changed battery out soon. Um, One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
seven yabbies. That is not bad. I didn't even get one out of the one that we put all the yabbies in. So, put these guys all back in the bag. Let them calm down a little bit. And then, um, do a feed. Alright, if we're going in. Oh, yeah. That is lovely. <laughs> that is nice and warm. Now a bit cold. That's why you gotta be careful swimming in dams. It's nice and warm in some spots and then it goes nice and um nice and cold. And your body's not used to it. So um I'll usually swim in a dam with people but people around but I just want to cool off. Because sometimes your body reacts different to the cold and the warm patches and you start you won't be able to swim yeah nice little cool off then let's cook some yabbies and probably go for a bit more of a swim i got ants everywhere anyways let's get this out there's one there oh my foot Fill up with water real quick. Hey. Nice, nice, nice. Alrighty, let's set you guys up. Everything's a bit wet. That's all right. It's not wet. Sorry about the sun. I had to move it away from there. So you good? Yeah. Good enough. Now reach in. Grab me gas ball, that's what flip that out. Nice. Yep. In a nice level. Nice. Now that'll warm up. The abbeys get cooked. And uh, hopefully these meat ants go away. Alrighty. New battery in the camera. I'll put my phone away because I um, don't want to get full out and get it wet. Um, got all the ants off us. The abbeys are nearly done. As you can tell, nice red there. Have a look on the top. Yeah, everything's fine. Keep tight nicely. Probably give that another five minutes. Um, yeah, not bad little video. Just in the back paddock here. That's the jeep right there. Um, yeah, if you like these kind of videos, drop a comment down below. Um, yeah. I was going to do a fire, but seeing the wind and the heat, I probably won't. 100% won't, actually. But, yeah, I've got some other videos in in mind that I'm looking at doing. Because of the hot weather's out, all the reptiles and other types of wildlife will be out. So, if you want to, like, see some videos of herping or anything, let us know. Um, more videos like this. Are, um, but, yeah, any videos, let us know down in the comments. Um, obviously, there will be good videos when dad's home because he can drive us places I can't yet and that's a thought on my motorbike but yeah I'd rather um, yeah, go in the car to the, and do it <coughs> but yeah I've scattered out a little creek um, and yeah I'm probably going to the next video I'll probably be out the creek catching yabbies um, so yeah stay tuned we'll have this feed we'll sign out and we'll, we'll uh, see you on the next video Hat with yabbies.
smoke in the water that came out of it as well. Even better. Yeah, be tail. I don't pull the poo shoot out, but you can. And the way you do that is you can either peel it back like that, slap that in your mouth, pull it out like that. Or before you cook them, let's see if they work. If it works when you've cooked them as well. Pretty much get this middle flap here. Grab it. Twist it. And pull it out. But because I've cooked it, it doesn't happen very easy. But before you cook it, do that. You get the poo tube out. But I honestly, think about what they eat. I honestly don't mind. I know what these guys eat because they're obviously on my property. But yeah, it's all digested and stuff by them. But yeah, have a look at that. Um, plenty of meat on them claws as well, so I'll probably go for the claws as well. <laughs> and it's good because these guys have really laid their eggs through the winter um, month. Um, and yeah, bred up through the spring and that. These guys won't have yabbies, babies, so yeah. That's it for this video. If you liked it, make sure you like, subscribe, share, and comment. <coughs> Let us know what you think. Hopefully this, crook, this sickness goes away. Summer, summer's coming. Nice, warm nights. Um, we could do some herping. Um, shit, we can do a herping, bloody everything, honestly. Herping, camping, yabbying, fishing, bloody night. Um, but yeah, let us know what summer videos want to see. More swimming. Anything, farm videos, anything. But yeah, that's it for me today. Hope you enjoyed and uh, you, we out.